Clemson lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 32. The Eagles in talking with them this week, Kirk, is just interesting, their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself, and I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'll be shocked if they can slow him down. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 31-yard line. Tackled after a decent pickup. The delayed handoff picks up about six yards there. That'll make it down and by. Right and left, right and left. Two down, two down. Hey, check right, 47, check right. And he's going to be sacked. Well, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. Kendrick awaiting the return. He's taken down at the 36 yard line. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Bring him down at the 50-yard line. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. From midfield, first down. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield. Five wide receivers in the formation. Fires across the middle. And down he goes at the 26. What a play. Boy, a solid job there by the quarterback, recognizing the defensive coverage and delivering the ball to the open receiver. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 26. Gets to about the 24-yard line. Gain of two yards. That brings up second and nine. Let's go. Let's get this ball back for the offense. Let's go. By 28. There's a strike complete. And he's tackled at about the 13. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. Gets it quickly to the tight end, but it's dropped. The pass was incomplete. Hey, it was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and ten. Five wide. Fires quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. He hits the PAT. A six-play, 63-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. So our score, 7-0. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Tigers are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. 
And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. He fights forward to about the 26. Second down and nine to go. Ball on their own 26. And off to the left. Gets to about the 27-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. The offensive line has got to do a better job of making space because that was just a punishing hit. to the 40 and he is drilled at the 42. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. From their own 42 yard line it's first down. couple of yards on the carry. That's a nice play there by the sophomore out in the corner. He read the run and stepped up and made a nice tackle. Tailback brought down for a loss. And the defensive end comes up with a big play. Boy, he's quick as a cat, no question. He got tremendous penetration and was able to wrap him up for a loss there. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Steps out of bounds at the 49. Carlson is the putter. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. Clemson up seven points. Let's go! Check, check! Stand right! They'll make the sack. It's a big-time effort sack by the defensive end. I want to also give some credit to the coverage downfield. The end never gave up on the play, but because the quarterback didn't have anywhere to go with the football, it gave the defensive end enough time to eventually chase the quarterback down for that sack. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. They come out in a five-wide set. Fires out to his wideout, and he's taken down at the 21. Setting up blockers or running backs got it on the screen. The screen pass goes nowhere. Well, you got to take your hat off to the defense. All week they preached over and over again how they were not going to let this kid use his speed in the open field, and they really shut him down that time. Gets to about the 44-yard line. Clemson's defense really came to play early in this football game. Well, they've done a good job here early, but you know eventually this offense is going to start clicking. Let's see if this defense can sustain this for the rest of the game. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And he tackles them hard at the 47. From their own 47-yard line, it's second down. He's tackled at the 44-yard line. The defensive end was the victor on that play as he bolted in to tackle him for a loss. And he's able to do that because the interior linemen held their ground, leaving the runner with no options. He 
is hit right away. Kendrick is back deep to return. And he's tackled at the 16. The offense takes the field again. They were forced to punt their last time out. Clemson is up by a touchdown. Brought down at about the 15-yard line. That is a loss of one yard. That'll bring up second and 12. From their own 15-yard line, it's second down. He's gobbled up in the backfield. The option can be really tough to defend. At that time, it was well played by the defense. First and ten, ball on the 28. They'll spread the field with five wide. Here's a give up the middle, tackled right away. No gain on the play. That makes it second and ten. at the 38-yard line. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. He's at midfield. Makes it to the 47. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 47. Clemson is up a score. He's taken down at about the 47-yard line. Nothing there on the keeper. And this is the eighth play of the drive. So at the end of one, the Tigers in front, 7-0. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Pushed out of bounds around the 31 yard line. First and 10, ball on the 31 yard line. Runs outside for a nice game. A four-yard gain by the halfback on the option. That makes it second and six. And this is the tenth play of the drive. Gets it out. He's met immediately. They lose seven yards on that play. Well, that's just a sound play by the defense. They dropped him well short of the line of scrimmage. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. Roger, Roger. Mike 28, Mike 28. 
Clemson is up seven. They bring the quarterback down. Wow, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman, when the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. Clemson can make this a two-possession game with this field goal. Kicks away, and it falls short. No good. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Nice run there. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. That brings them second and five. From their own 47-yard line, second down. Just throws this one away. Throws to the receiver, incomplete. They're going to be forced to punt it away here. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. Carlson is waiting for the snap. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Clemson up seven points. And they make the stop around the 40-yard line. From their own 40-yard line. First down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. And a quick throw. They'll bring him down at about the 49. I'm really liking what I see from this guy. He's not afraid to go to the air on any down. immediately in the backfield. Well, give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. So it's second and 12. Ball on the 49-yard line. He steps out around the 46-yard line. He throws right. Open man, and it's his wide receiver. And they finally knock him out at the two. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Clemson is up by a touchdown. And he adds the extra point. It was a six play, 78 yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook try. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run in the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. The 
Eagles know, I think, that at some point they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. It's second and 13. Ball on their own 13. Dillon will run it again. Nice run to the outside. He gets rid of this one. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass, and they defended the play very well in the second half. Kendrick waiting the return. <laughs> Decent effort. He's not the type of guy to call a fair catch very often. He does have the ability to make guys miss. The offense was able to punch it in the end zone on that last drive. They'll come back out looking for more of the same. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. And right now with this offense, they are in sync, and really the timing and execution is flawless. That was a good play by the halfback. Picked up about five yards on the option. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Makes it to the 34. The reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing. They have no idea whether you're passing or running, even if you need medium to long range yards. Five wide. Tackled after decent pickup. They're about four yards away here on second down. Now he pitches it. He's knocked out of bounds at the 26-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That'll bring up third and two. And down he goes at the 14-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 14-yard line. And he's tackled at about the 11. That'll make it second and seven. They come out on an empty backfield. Pulls it in and stops in his tracks with that tackle. Here's the eighth play of the series. Throws it out right to the running back. And he's taken down around the eight-yard line. This one should be makeable. That makes it fourth and four. He gets it up, and it's good. Well, that one looked like it was going to be wide, but he put it inside the upright. Yeah, he squeaked that one in, and he didn't have much more than a couple of inches to spare. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20 at the 30. Knocked out of bounds at the 45. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Going long. And he's got the junior. And he will score.
This offense just has so many weapons to defend. They've got some genuine playmakers. And he converts the extra point. Carlson gets set to kick this one away. He'll take it from the two. Tackle at the 18-yard line. The Tigers are just cruising through this first half. There will be really a comfortable lead here. Yep, but still a lot of football left to be played. they got to remember that it's a four-quarter game, and even though that first half went pretty well, things can change in a hurry. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 18. They'll knock him down for a loss. Loss of three. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. And they get nice yardage on that run. And that brings up fourth down. Great stop by the defense. They played with tremendous character on those downs. And watch out. They're going to bring the heat right here. He's taken down at the 46. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He's got it with room to run. He's tackled at the 44. That brings up second and one. He makes the catch and has a first down. That's a great tackle at the 36. First down. They come out in a five wide set. He's at the 20. And he's knocked down immediately after the catch. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. From the 20 yard line, first down. left and he's taken down in the backfield. Wants to throw outside. That is receiver touchdown. They look awesome on that play. A well-thrown football and a great effort to get the ball into the end zone. Here's the extra point to draw within three points. And he tacks on the extra point. Boston College ready to kick this one off. Kendrick fields it at the three. He's tackled at the 28. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Throws this one out to the left. It's caught first down, and he's out of bounds. From their own 47-yard line, it's first down. Clemson is up by three. Zips it right. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch.
Gets it out quickly. Brought down at the 16-yard line. This isn't even the best example, but I'm going to tell you something. This young man is really getting better at running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. And he makes it out to about the 14-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. If it's any consolation, he did pick up some positive yards, but I doubt that's enough to make him forget the hit that he just took. And he carries the ball for a nice game. He's at 100 yards rushing for the day. You just can't say enough about the job the offensive line has done. They've kept the running lanes open and given him all kinds of space to maneuver. Tackle made at the five. In the shotgun and five wideouts. Finds a man, touchdown. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And that'll do it for the first half. 24-14, Clemson. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Steve Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Both of these defenses are opportunistic. They're very good at forcing turnovers. But both quarterbacks, David, have done a very good job while trying to maintain an aggressive mindset. They haven't forced the ball. The runners have done a good job keeping it put away. Yeah, and as much as you preach that all throughout the week, it's still hard to do. It's hard to execute. And being able to see what you see on the defensive side of the football and adjust to it offensively. How about protecting the quarterback so he's not getting hit from the blind side, fumbling the football, ball carriers running with the football, keeping it tight to their body, not giving it away. So, you know, between running backs, receivers, and quarterbacks, offensive linemen blocking, did a great job executing on the offensive side of the football, not to, create, not to give away any turnovers. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Red and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here, just about set for the second half. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 26. We're about set to start things up again. Fires out quickly to the tailback. He's taken down at the 32. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Big opening. Tackle around the 42-yard line. Second, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. Just throws this one away. the long yardage and now they'll have to punt. It's a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. And they're coming after this punter. He makes it out to maybe the 23 yard line. 
There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He makes his way out to about the 35. From their own 35-yard line. First down. Now he's scrambling. Decides to slide. Brown picks up about seven yards there, scrambling away from the pressure. Some open field. They'll bring him down around the 49 yard line. That's a gain of nine on the play. That makes it first and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 49 yard line. They hand it off again. And they make the stop around the 46 yard line. The back gets three on the carry. This linebacker's had a couple of years of experience, and he's really solidified himself as a reliable tackler, as you can see from that last stop. Gets to about the 44 yard line. From the 44 yard line, third down. They'll spread the field with five wide. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Their last drive broke down and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? Fires it out. He gets hit out of bounds at the 25 yard line. From their own 25 yard line, second down. Throws complete, and he's got space to work. And they push him out at the 37. Nice run, and he's brought down. From their own 42 yard line. Second down. He makes it out to maybe the 43 yard line. single pass play, but it doesn't always happen. And down he goes at the 48-yard line. The defense needs to be careful. Safety might have made that play, but if he keeps coming up on the run, there'll be space downfield for the pass. They'll line it up again on third down. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Rifles it right side, in and out of his hands. Overton was the intended receiver on the way. That makes it fourth and 12. Dillon is back to receive. Throws 
Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. The offense takes the field again. They were forced to punt their last time out. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. And he's tackled at the 22. From their own 22-yard line, it's second down. They go to the run, and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. So the halfback loses about two on the run. Plays it out there. Missed him. Excellent series by this defense, forcing them to go three and out. And the offense really struggled on this drive. They're going to have to pick it up if they want to move the ball on these guys. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Got the corner. Kendrick fields it at the 35. And he's tackled at the 48. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Quick strike to the receiver. And he's taken down right around the 42-yard line. From the 42-yard line, first down. He's on the run. And he is drilled at the 46-yard line. Loss of four yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 15. From the 46-yard line, second down. He goes out of bounds at the 41. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Zips it to the back. He's tackled around the 27-yard line. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 27. Quick toss. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. They'll line up with five wide receivers. And he hauls that one in. And he's level at the 15-yard line. From the 15-yard line, it's first down. Throws complete, and he stopped immediately. This is the eighth play of this drive. He fights forward to about the seven. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming at them, but they just couldn't stop it.
and he converts the extra point. A nine-play, 51-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. So our score, 31-14. Clemson is lining up to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They couldn't get anything going on that last drive. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Nice run up the middle. Call it a game of six yards. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's good for a gain of five yards. First down. Check tight right, tight right, tight right. Pull up there, check the outside there. Pull down, pull down. They hand it off. He makes his way to about the 48. Gain of 12 on the play. First down. From their own 48-yard line. First down. We played three, and this one's pretty much gone as expected. The Tigers lead it by 17. All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Tackled back behind the line of scrimmage. That'll bring up second and eleven. From their own 47-yard line, it's second down. Carries the ball for a nice game. That's a game of five on the ball. Third down. Man left, man left. Go down, go down. Hey, check back for the seven. Check back for the seven. Down. Blue the cut. He's scrambling. And they got him. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. He's going to try and scramble. Here he goes. And now he's going to improvise. Slides down. That's a game of 10 on the play. Here's the eighth play of the series. Throws in the middle, brought down at the 26. First and 10. Ball on the 26 yard line. Scrambling around. Slides down to the ground. Well, they didn't get the first down, but it was still a pretty good run by the quarterback. He made a good decision to take off there. Here's play number 10 on the drive. at the 17 and he gets a yard on the run it's third down and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker tackle made right around the 16 yard line
tries to scramble, but he's sacked. I'm not sure the offense had much of a choice here. It was a pretty short conversion. The defense just made a good play. You really can't say enough about this defense. Fourth and short, and they really showed up on that play. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. He's to the 40. Across midfield. At the 30. Out of bounds at about the 21. First and ten with a defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. Quick out to his receiver. Touchdown, Tigers! And he adds the extra point. Clemson is ready to kick it away. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. They come out in a five-wide set. He scrambled. They'll bring him down at the 38. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 38. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Got his receiver. Dropped it. Incomplete. They come out on an empty backfield. Caught out in the open. He's taken down at the 44-yard line. That's a game of 18 on the way. First down. From the 44-yard line. First down. 47 right, 47 right. Right, 47. Down. 10, 19. Cut. Now he's scrambling. And he's sacked. So it's second down and 13 yards to go following that quarterback sack. Five wide. Get to that quickly. Yellowway gains four yards on that reception. He wants it all going long, and he makes a catch. He's all the way home. Touchdown. Make it three passes for touchdowns. What I'm noticing more and more about this guy is he's very patient with the ball, and it's resulting in some nice scores, just like we've seen today. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. Now he tries to buy some time. And they won't get the two. 
A six play 74 yard drive but they just get six points after failing to convert for two. Brad I love these kind of drives. They're old school grind it out and earn the yards and just rip the heart right out of that defense. So the score now 38 20. He's tackled at the 44 and for Lawrence he's racked up solid passing stats. Oh he's obviously come in here with a plan. He knows what he wants to do and he's just getting the job done. The thing that surprised me today is that we know about his ability to throw the football but here's a guy that can also hurt you with his feet if he has to. All of his success has led to their advantage on the scoreboard. The offense now will take the field and they hope to have the same success they had on their last drive. You know, when this defense went over to the sideline based on the way they've been playing so far, this defense coordinator has got to be livid. Uh, he's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. Because when you play defense, it's not just about X's and O's. It's about attitude and playing with a lot of confidence. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. the 26 yard line. Just over two minutes in the game. up four. Gaining four yards. Third down. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. the PAT. So that's a seven play, 44 yard drive. And the result, seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. Clemson to kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Eagles thought they had the right game plan and the right player to do it. Neither worked out for them. Yeah, I think the, the game plan and the star player came into this game with a lot of confidence. What they weren't able to really think about was how good this defense would be that they were facing today. And today, they just got completely shut down. 
Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. So a nice little pitch and catch there, and that'll give the offense a first down. That was a very good-looking pass play to get more than enough yards to move the chains. Just over a minute left. And he's taken down around the 44-yard line. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. He's tackled at the 46-yard line. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Uh, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver, and the result, again, a nice play for the offense. Makes it out to about the 36, and that'll be a gain of 10 by the running back. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. They bring him down. They've really thrown the quarterback's rhythm off and rattled his confidence with such a relentless pass rush. He's not himself out there at all today. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. After decent pickups. Makes the second ball. That's good for a gain of four yards. First down. Check. Tight right. Tight right. Tight right. Go out there. Check out. He makes his way out to about the 25. Gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. going to do it for this one. Our final score, Clemson 45, Boston College 20. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. It's a really good job by the coaches here by not letting them take an underdog lightly and really getting after it from the very beginning of this game. Clemson played a terrific game today. Even better than I thought they would. Top to bottom, they just looked out of sight. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.